my first doorbell review. Um, I'm making videos for four different doorbells. They are basically like a budget doorbells where you know you don't have to spend uh, you know 100 200 dollars. Um, this one is about hundred dollars. It's a really good doorbell. So I'm gonna open and show you what I got on this one. It's uh, it has pretty much everything that you can get from Ring or Nest or doorbells those expensive ones so the whole purpose of this video is to show you that there are other alternatives that you can explore so all right guys so let's open this box let's see what we got inside it's a it's a very strong box good quality box um what we got inside is the instruction manual right here low power battery one thing i really like is it has a stamp that show you that exactly when it was manufactured so this is really good like it's uh, it was done in November 15th 2018 so really good information nicely done here's the bell you can take the bell out uh, one thing I wanted to tell you is you know this guy right here this is actually a Wi-Fi doorbell so when what's happened is you know your phone is connected to your app people are standing outside and you turn off the notification because the camera will send you a notification even when the people are passing by. So this is really helpful if you are in your bathroom, not close to the phone or in a closet or busy doing something. This will chime and you will know that there is somebody on the front door. Very important, It cut, the package comes with that. The package also comes with the batteries right here. Um, the cables on the back side of the you can connect the cables right here and you can take the cables out from the existing doorbell button and reconnect here and they will provide enough power to charge these batteries so very good function you can let me take the cover out right here is the sd card that's where all the movement all the storage video storage is going right here and by the way, it records audio, so you can play back on your app, and uh, you will know, like, you know, you can see the 8 seconds, 9 seconds delay. Take the this out, and inside is, you will have a USB to actually read the videos or copy the videos out from the SD card. It's really great that they actually give you a SD card, 16 gigabyte, not much, but still it's good enough for a year or two. Um, you know, video recording comes with the USB cable and the screws to you know connect it to the to the wall. So pretty much full complete package. I mean, you know, that's what you got: the SD card, the USB. Uh, the doorbell I mean everything looks perfect on this next step I'm going to show you how we can set up this on the phone alright guys so we're going to download the app based on the instruction that came with it we have to download the app called Any Home and it's available on Android and Mac so iOS and Android is available just type any home and you should be able to download that app all right guys so i'm gonna type any home right there it pop up let's install this guy it's downloading all right so it's a hundred percent install and i'm gonna install that installing i'm gonna open this Make sure your Wi-Fi is connected to your network. So click open. It's going to basically ask you to access your photos, audio, and all that. Make sure you said yes. Yes. Otherwise, uh, cancel this notification. Click on add camera. And setup device. I'm going to stop right here. I am going to put this phone here, open the back cover of this thing, 
and add the right there. Connect the batteries. Put the cover back. A little bit tricky and it's ready to go it's ready to connect so here guys so the camera light is blinking we're gonna click on setup device and it's gonna say connect yes enter the password for your Wi-Fi All right, bearing information received. All right, so it is ready to connect. You can assign the password. The password that you're gonna enter here is basically for the doorbell. So I entered the password and it's connect now. So if I press here, it's, it, it's right there, you can see that the camera is right there it's moving and it's uh i mean you know it's connecting so it's connected now now the next step is we're gonna take this guy and put it on the nearest uh plug it needs a power so you can plug in wherever if it's a Two-story house, you need to plug in where, you know, you, well, everybody can hear. So you need to plug into the power and it will connect with your phone. So now the doorbell is ready to connect. I mean, I can literally connect, take this and put the back plate on it and I can connect it directly to the wall outside. And that's what I'm going to show you next. So let, let's put this here. All right, guys, so the next step is I'm going to put this plate right here. I'm going to take this guy out, take the cables out, and we're going to put the cables right here. All right. So. <laughs> Couple of things before we uh, put the bell on, we gotta put the SD card in. Make sure you put the SD card right there, right there. And after that, connect the batteries right there. Connect the batteries and put the plate on, and you're ready to go. All right, guys so the bell is connected now and I just have to test the bell so let's do that all right guys the so last step is we're gonna put this chime in to the center area where everybody can hear this and it is connected now so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to open the app on my phone and make sure that the phone is connected. Phone is connected. Okay, so very first thing when you open the app is the settings right there and it's call in. I'm going to leave it to notification. I don't want to have a call coming in on my phone because I have... Um, chime right there connected so i don't want it to have it ringing on my phone and over there 
depend on like you know where I am if I'm outside of my house yeah so some of the settings is you know you if somebody is on the door and you wanted to talk to that individual yes you can press the button right there and you can talk to them um, you can always hear the sound coming from outside so I'm gonna turn this off and now it's off um, most important setting is SD card cloud storage cloud storage is basically you can see 14.7 gigabyte the card the SD card comes with the package once you turn on the cloud storage it can start recording eight second videos for you and again there is no subscription fees you can just record everything on the on the phone orientation I wanted to leave it normal um, environmental I wanted to read it dynamic so dynamic is basically it can move from day and night automatically PIR detection I wanted to leave it on low because even when it's low then if somebody needs to be really close to the camera and that's when it's gonna dial in um, otherwise it's not gonna dial in LED enable and door messy time 15 seconds other than that everything is pretty straightforward normal there's nothing you need to worry about and the uh, cloud storage if you click on cloud storage you can see the videos are already there and if I click on it I can see right there the bell is ringing so it record um, everything right there again the mic is on I wanted to turn that off and so it's pretty straightforward uh, settings if you have any question feel free to contact me and I would love to answer you if you have any question thanks guys okay, so I hope you enjoyed the video now the big question is is this worth it uh, it's definitely worth it um, you know it's been a couple days now and it's definitely worth it it's only uh, $69 on Amazon again I'm not selling this it's just my recommendation that it comes with the SD card it comes with the doorbell comes with the batteries and a chime so what I was missing I mean you know I like I said that in my in my video that I don't want to spend 100 bucks this is a perfect alternative it has a cloud storage too that means you can access anytime somebody comes close to the uh, doorbell uh, no separation fees big big I mean you know otherwise you buy a nest or a ring you have to pay a subscription fee so I would definitely recommend you try it let me know